Most graphic novels are created through collaboration. This video explains how to include graphic novels created by two or more individuals in your Works Cited list, according to the seventh edition of the MLA Handbook, and what to do with multi-volume graphic novels. If you have a graphic novel where only a single person was involved in its creation, the same person wrote and illustrated it, like for example Art Spiegelman's Mouse, you can simply watch our video MLA Style Works Cited List Citing Books. For other graphic novels, where you have a writer, an artist, and possibly other collaborators like a letterer or colorist, which name do you list first when you're citing it? The answer is the name of the person whose contribution is most relevant to your research. Let's take Watchmen for example. If you were doing an English paper on Alan Moore and he was the most relevant to your research, then you would begin the citation with his name. In this case, start with the writer's last name, followed by their first name, followed by a label identifying their role, in this case, writer. Make sure you use the terms provided on the book's title page. Next, enter the title of the graphic novel in italics. After the title, list the other collaborators. For illustrator letterer Dave Gibbons, you would write illustrated slash lettered by Dave Gibbons. MLA typically abbreviates illustrator. For colorist John Higgins, you would write colored by John Higgins. Then enter the city of publication followed by a colon. There's no need to include the state or province. Then the publisher's name followed by a comma and the year of publication followed by a period. Finally, indicate the medium of publication. Medium refers to the format. For graphic novels, the medium would be print. If you are doing an art history paper and comparing different drawing styles, Dave Gibbons might be the most relevant to your research. Then you would begin the citation with his name, followed by the label, illustrator slash letterer. After the title, you would write, written by Alan Moore. Many graphic novels are part of a multi-volume series, and individual volumes can have their own titles. After the first name, enter the title of the individual volume in italics. The year should indicate when that volume was published. At the end of the citation, after the medium, indicate the volume number and the name of the series in italics. In this case, the hard goodbye is volume one of Frank Miller's Sin City. Thanks for watching. For more information about MLA style, check out our other videos or visit the Munn Libraries webpage for our MLA guide and to chat live with library staff.